Today I show you how to remove a keyboard input language from your Android phone. I use the Google Keyboard or Gboard app, but you can do this with most of the keyboard apps on Samsung. It might be a little bit different, but in general, the settings will be the same, similar. To open the keyboard, you have to go to an app that has keyboard input. So here, here for example, I have Greek and I want to remove Greek from the phone so I won't be able to type in Greek. To check which languages are installed, I long press on the space there and I see English, Russian, Romanian and Greek. So it's already two, four languages, it's getting a bit crowded. There are really a lot of languages here, but I guess there could be more, so I don't know. This is an example for you here. I actually might need to keep the Greek language, but I don't know, I'll think about it. But it's easy, always easy to remove or, or add. These, the languages are very easy to, to change on the keyboard. So to do that on the Gboard on Android, I here you see I have these corrections and I want to remove them. I go into this, the menu there and tap on the gear icon. Normally you would see the gear icons like that if you don't type something you would see them here if you're not into in the middle of typing a word and this is the same screen here i have the settings here i have settings and languages so type on languages and i have all these languages here and i can choose this pencil edit icon tap on that and all i can do now now all i have to do is select the languages i want to remove and I will select one language, the Greek, and then you have the bin, press on the bin, and it's gone. So now Greek is removed, and you can also rearrange languages if you wanted to. I can move one language higher than the other one, for example, if I want the sort order to be different, or if I want to remove another language, I could also press this pencil icon and remove it like that. So now I have English and Romanian on my phone and it's easier to type in this way. I still have whatever I typed in Greek there before, but now if I switch between English and Romanian, it's going to be much easier to type. It's much, much easier. And if I could, I could actually keep it like this in row N, like that. In this mode, it will try to guess the word if it's either in Romanian or in English. It's really convenient. So for example, see that's a word in a sentence in English and now Hello, how are you? See, sentence, sentence in Romanian, sentence in English. I wrote something in Romanian and I also wrote something in English without having to switch the language. And I actually prefer this way. This is my favorite way. Not have it to English only, to have it in both. Because sometimes when I type on forums, on Reddit usually, when I type, my typing is really bad because I, I didn't have the Romanian and English. And anyway, my typing is pretty bad anyway in general. So... I don't really try to correct the text much on forums on the internet when I type and uh, I rely on the auto autocorrect I can see that what, when there's a mistake but if you're typing something on a on reddit or on a forum it doesn't matter let the people complain about your grammar mistakes thanks for watching that's how you remove the language two languages